A pre-celebration in the August Wilson Theater's new Wilson Lounge held up opening night of Slave Play on Thursday. DJ Poppy Juice spun tunes in the new lounge and playwright Jeremy O'Harris had an impromptu dance party as A-list guests like Zach Posen, Jennifer Coolidge, Meryl Streep, Mommy Gummer and Mark Ronson cheered along. It was a raucous pre-show party. The show started an hour past its scheduled start time, a source told Page Six. Playwright Dominique Morisot, Christopher Tierney, Andrew Burnap, producer Greg Nobile, Devin Tynes and Harris Paulina Dunham also came out for opening night. Broadway producer and theater owner Jordan Roth was decked out in a black and white look in New York ensemble. He posted a video from the party to Instagram of himself dancing to Aretha Franklin's A Deeper Love and photographer Emilio Madrid's Magical Mirror of Clint Ramos's Magnificent Mirror Set, he wrote. The Wilson Lounge debuted last month during Slave Play previews and features seating areas, a curated library stocked with plays by black playwrights, and a dedicated concierge. Theater Insider predicted, it will become a cool hub. Streep was overheard gushing to Ramos about the lounge and Harris hit play, a spy told Page Six. Guests continued the opening night celebration at Tao Downtown for an official afterparty. Harris play set a Tony record this year with 12 nominations, including Best Play, though he lost out on every single one. He consoled himself with two Tonys after parties, though, the show runs through January 23rd.